The three-match T20 international series between Pakistan and Sri Lanka will commence tomorrow in the UAE. The first two T20 internationals on October 26th and 27th will be played in Abu Dhabi before the teams move to Lahore for the third and final game on the 29th. All-rounder Tissera Pereira will lead the Sri Lankan team, becoming their ninth captain in the shortest format of the game. Several senior players, including limited overs captain Upul Taranga, showed reluctance to travel to Pakistan for the third and final game and have been left out of the squad. Head coach Nick Potas and physiotherapist Nirmal and Thanabala Singham have also refused to travel to Lahore but are likely to be with the team for the UAE leg. This will be the first time a Sri Lankan outfit will tour Pakistan since the terrorist attack on the team bus in 2009. Following a 5-0 defeat in the ODIs, the visitors will look for an improved performance with plenty of young T20 international players in the lineup. The host, meanwhile, will look to maintain their dominant form in coloured clothing. In the past, 15 T20 internationals have been played between these two nations, with Pakistan winning 10 games and Sri Lanka claiming only 5 wins. Pakistan have played 5 T20 internationals in Abu Dhabi, winning 2 and losing 3. Meanwhile, Sri Lanka have lost the solitary T20 international they played against Pakistan in Abu Dhabi. The selectors have been forced to make 9 changes to the squad from the one that took on India last month, with left-handed opener Danush Kugunathilaka who served a suspension for breach of discipline among those making a return to international cricket. 31-year-old batsman Mahel Udavatta, who last played for Sri Lanka in 2009, has also been named in the squad alongside uncapped wicketkeeper batsman Minod Banuka, who has received his maiden national call-up. Sri Lanka T20 international squad comprises of Tisara Pereira, Tilshan Munavira, Tanushka Gunatilaka, Sadira Samara Vikrama, Minod Banuka, Ashan Priyanjan, Mahel Udavatta, Tasun Shanaka, Sachit Pathirana, Siku Ge Prasanna, Jeffrey Van Der See, Chaturanga Di Silva, Vikum Sanja, Lahiru Gamage, Vishwa Fernando and Isirudana. Pakistan's T20 international squad is almost identical to the one that played the three games against the touring World Eleven side in Lahore last month. Suhail Khan was flown in as cover for the then expectant father Mohammad Amir is the only notable absentee from the squad. All-rounder Mohammad Hafiz, who played in the T20 internationals in West Indies in March but was not part of the squad last month, finds himself reinstated to play in the 20-over format. The Pakistan T20 international squad comprises of Safraz Ahmad, Fakar Zaman, Ahmad Shesad, Babar Azam, Shoaib Malik, Mohammad Hafiz, Imad Wazim, Shadab Khan, Mohammad Nawaz, Fahim Ashraf, Hassan Ali, Amar Yamin, Mohammad Amir, Rumman Rais, Usman Shinwari, and Umar Ramin. Despite a disastrous run in ODIs, Sri Lanka have done well in T20 international cricket this year, winning 5 out of 9 matches they have played and thus the series is expected to be a closely contested one.